never hunted archery antelope out of a blind before, so this will all be new to us and probably going to be a whole bunch of new learning experiences one after another, I'm sure. Sun's out, smoke has cleared out. It's a nice, nice day, so hopefully it gets thirsty and actually comes into water. Glassing this all morning <laughs> and nothing, and then just poof out in the little sagebrush pops up a buck. Just don't willing him to come this way because that's all we can do in a blind. Six days of sitting, and we have had one buck within 75 yards, and we have not had an antelope drink in front of us. Definitely antelope prairie. I think we're gonna call an audible. Uh, we've been driving around trying to do some spot and stock today, and we've stumbled upon this beautiful water trough that's overflowing that had 50 antelope around it and no blind. So I think we're going to go tear ours down and uh, relocate it for the rest of the season. So probably going to be a late night. Yeah, those two are really heavy. That's the most two by fours on our side. It's just 
day seven in the blind, I think, and day one at the new location. But first archery antelope my bow. Pretty pumped. Yeah, a few hours of hard work with me last night ended up being worth it. But uh, the day before elk season starts, we finally got it done. Now it's Jess's turn. Good morning from the Antelope Blind. This is uh, Friday, September 3rd, and I'm solo for the next two days in this box. Um, it's supposed to be pretty hot, so the box should be thirsty, I'd think. There's tons of fresh sign. Uh, feeling pretty good about it, but uh, I believe this is day nine of sitting in the Antelope Blind for me, and uh, it's been tough just to sit in a box and wait for things to happen, so feeling confident. Got my lucky underwear, got my lucky bra on. So, see what happens.
Sasha my antelope tag.